this stage of the game, I'm still forced sometimes to use them. In dressing rooms that I have custom marked the most extraordinary new star. They frequently just abbreviate it M-E-N-S. There's a nice graphic shot for you there. When the doctor says it's funny and his mama thinks it's strange, walks around East Baltimore making spell change. He's a big bad boy. We're just a big bad boy. He's a big bad boy with a red dress on. Some Showtime. say it's just genetic, some say it's just a freak Cause he watches Richard Simmons eat yogurt twice a week He's a big bad boy He's just a big bad boy He's just a big bad boy With a red dress on What went wrong with the My style of music is what we call warpability Or R&P as opposed to R&B R&B being rhythm and blues, R&P being ranting and peculiarity I want to be the next Rick Springfield of Baltimore I want to be popular and have all the girls like me Look at that. Oh, hallelujah. She's being healed, ladies and gentlemen. Well, yeah, Reverend Billy Words grew out of a night with Thunderbird wine. I had always sort of been known to sort of sermonize and pontificate among sin and, and, and teenage self-abuse in, in, in American society anyway. And it was a good way to get girls' attentions or certain kind of girls' attentions at parties. You know? I do it with a bow constrictor wrapped around my neck. I really made a big hit at parties. You know? She's been touched. Young America, look at this. This could be you right now. This could be you being touched and helped by Reverend Billy Wirtz instead of sitting at home smoking Lord knows what in front of your TV set. I, I think that the kids started wearing leisure suits again and cutting their hair, <laughs> that we could get back on the road to decency and we wouldn't have the problems with kids going deaf and insane at an early age from listening to Walkman radios and, and being permanently injured and unable to bear children because of these Nautilus machines that they, uh, they work out on. I can't throw a baseball. I don't know how to work on cars. I've got bad sinus problems. I get beat up in bars. I wear corrective shoes. Reverend Billy has saved me. And my breath ain't so hot. Laying on his head. I've got an acne problem. He's touched me. And my palms sweat a lot. He saved me for himself. Oh, I played organ and guitar with groups as a teenager primarily to attract girls' attention because I was about this height and I weighed about 30 pounds less and I had real bad acne and I was real self-conscious. I couldn't lay organ all that well, but I moved real good and I had good clothes, you know. Well, my brother is my uncle, my daddy is my cousin, my nephew is my brother, and oh, see, they're being touched. My sister is my aunt, mama was a sheep, the sweetest thing that you ever saw. I always was sort of the clown in the bands because I would get bored playing the same songs over and over and also looking at just drunk people every night begin to sort of wear on one's psyche. And so I'd begin to hang upside down behind the piano or stick cigarettes up my nose and we were playing like a real sensitive love song or a real country weeper, you know. There goes my only possession. Look at these young people out there. Raise your hands if you're being saved out there tonight, young America. Look at them. Look at the faces. Smile for the man there. Give him a good smile. Yes, indeed. Because we're in bread, in bread. To us, it's a way of life. I got a cute little sister. How old? She's only 13. Tomorrow, I'm going to make her my own. Uh, let me get a hallelujah if you're in bread and proud out there tonight. You believe that they're going to put this on TV? <laughs> Can I get an amen? Yeah. Hallelujah, friends. You don't need to be sending your money off to them other geeks. You don't need to.